Hello everyone. In the last video, we have seen how to install and configure the Nginx application to multiple Linux servers using Ansible playbook. We have written Ansible playbook and we have used the inventory to install and configure the Nginx server in all the three target servers. In this video, we will see how can we create an Ansible role and how can we use the role in the playbook to perform the required configuration in the target servers. And also in the last video, we have used the default index.html of nginx server. In this video, we will add a custom template using Jinja templates. So let us perform these things in the demo. Let us start. This is the source machine and this is the playbook we have written in the last session. To see the part 1 of the demo, please go through the video in the description. So now let us create an Ansible role using Ansible Galaxy. So let us execute Ansible Galaxy. Here we name the role as web server and we have to provide the directory for the role. So now the new role will be initialized under this directory. So let us execute this command. Now we can see a role is created successfully. So let us go into the directory. So now we can go to the roles. Here a new role is created called web server. So under web server role we can see multiple directories. So let us go to the tasks directory. So here we have main.ml. So as of now this is empty. So whatever tasks we have written for nginx configuration in the playbook.ml, we will transfer those tasks to this main.ml file. So let us open the content of the playbook before writing in the main.ml file. So all these tasks will be transferred to the main.ml of the web server role. So let us copy this. So now open the main.ml. So we have to change the indentation. So we have changed the indentation for all these tasks. So now the main.ml is ready with all the required tasks to configure nginx server. So let us save this file. So now we have changed the main.yaml of the web server role. So now we have to include this role in the playbook.yaml. For that we need to change our playbook.yaml file. So let us do that. So now instead of the tasks here we have to specify the role. So let us include the role now. So our role name is web server. So now we have replaced all the tasks with the role name. So let us save this playbook. So now we have changed the playbook. So now let us execute the playbook using Ansible playbook command. So now the playbook is getting executed. So now the playbook is executed successfully without any errors. So now let us connect to one of the servers and see whether nginx is accessible. So this is the target to machine. So let us access using call command. So now the index page is accessible in the target to. Similarly we can verify in other servers as well. So now we have seen how a role is created using Ansible Galaxy and how the role is included in the Ansible playbook. So till now we have used the default index HTML of nginx server. So now let us change the HTML to the custom index HTML using Jinja templates. So let us log into the source machine and create a template. So we will create a new template in the web server role. So let us go to the web server role. So here there is a directory called templates. So we have to put our custom templates in this templates directory. So let us go inside these templates and here we can create any template. So let me open index.html.j2. So this is a Jinja template. So we can add the HTML tags here. 
So let me add a simple HTML tag. So we can add more tags here, but I'm keeping it simple. So let me save this file. The custom template is saved now. So now we need to include this HTML template in the main.yaml file of web server role. So let us open the main.yaml now. So before starting nginx server here, we need to copy this template as an index.html file in the root directory of nginx server. So let us add a new task here. So here we need to add the task as template. This template task will allow us to copy the templates from the templates directory. So here we need to mention the source and destination. Source is our index.html.j2, so which is the file we have created just now. And we need to mention the destination. So for destination, we need to provide the full path of the HTML directory inside Nginx server. So this is the full path of the index.html in the Nginx server. So let us save this file and execute the playbook. Let us go to the playbooks directory. Now execute the playbook using Ansible playbook command. So now it has executed a new task which is adding the index space to the nginx server. After that the nginx is started. So now let us go to one of the servers and verify the index space by executing curl command. So this is the target one machine. Let us execute the curl command here. So now it has given the output as the content of our custom template. So this way we can add templates in the templates directory of corresponding role and we can copy the templates to the required destinations. So now we have covered the templates part as well. So in these two videos, we have covered how to write an Ansible playbook and how to make the inventory, how to prepare a template and how to create the roles and use the roles in the Ansible playbook to install and configure the required configurations in the target servers. If you like the content, please like, share and subscribe. Thanks a lot for watching.